So we're going to talk about the number 8128 and it's a famous type of number called perfect number. Now this was the largest perfect number known in antiquity or for a very long time. But what is a perfect number? The smallest perfect number is the number 6. So let's look at the number 6. Now what does it mean? What divides into 6? Well, 1 divides into 6, that's always true, 2 divides into 6, and 3 divides into 6. Now, 6 does divide as well, but for what we're going to do, we're going to ignore the number itself. So we ignore 6, but if we add up the numbers that divide 6, 1, 2, and 3, add them together, and we get the number 6. We get the number itself. So this is a perfect number because the divisors add up to the number itself. It's not too small and it's not too big, it's just right, it's perfect. And in antiquity, they were given this rare, perfect property. Uh, so the next one, after six, is the number 28. Let's write that down, 28. So what divides 28? Add these together and you get the number 28. It's the second perfect number. The third perfect number, after that, bit of a gap after that, the third perfect number is 496. 496. Let's look at the divisors of this. Uh, we've got one, quite a few of these, 2, 62, 124, 248, running off the edge. We add all this together in the same way as before, we get 496 again it's perfect now there's only one perfect number between 1 and 10 that's the number 6 there's only one perfect number between 10 and 100 that's 28 there's only one perfect number between 100 and 1000 496 and there is only one perfect number between 1000 and 10,000 and that is 8128 let's try it out then okay one Two, four, eight, two thousand and thirty-two, and four thousand sixty-four. Four thousand and sixty-four. Add those together in the same way, and you will get eight thousand one hundred twenty-eight. Today, even with our computers that can compute massive numbers, we have only found forty-seven perfect numbers. That is all. Four were known to the ancient Greeks, still today, 21st century, 47 we've got. There may be more, there may not be. We don't know if there's an infinite many of these numbers, uh, and that's an open question. Uh, you'd think that that's something we would know by now. Are there infinitely many of these or aren't there? We don't know the answer to that yet. What's the biggest perfect number? <laughs> uh, so far, I wouldn't know that. Let's find out the largest perfect number. Hmm. Well, hey, Wolfram Alpha says, do you mean largest integer? There's no largest integer. So that's helpful. Interestingly, um, we don't know if there are odd perfect numbers either. All the perfect numbers we have found are even. That's another question we don't know. The largest known perfect number is apparently... 1,791,000 digits long. Uh, don't ask me to say it, we could be here till next week. But that is the full thing. Nearly 2 million digits long. I could be scrolling for quite some time. 